Hey, how's it going? Uh, today's a good day, man. Um, well, it started out kind of weird because it's raining and it was freezing, so I couldn't go to the... In half market. a mile, take exit 29 toward US 30, Barrington. So I'm going to take that exit, and uh, <laughs> I'm on my way to House of Fun, man. It's a freaking toy store. Um, they have Hot Wheels, they have vintage toys, they have new toys, uh, they have all sorts of stuff. And uh, I'm heading over there, and I'm going to show you guys what's going on and uh, what they got. And um, take exit you know 29. I'm going to look at freaking Hot Wheels. I'm going to take exit 29. Back up! There it is, behind that pole. <laughs> oh my god, it's still tiny, but... Um, yeah, I just saw it on uh, Andre's channel, and um, they moved, so I've been to their old location, and that was a very tiny location, but it was always fun to go there. But uh, looks like this is a new one, and uh, there it is on White Horse Pike in New Jersey. So, um, yeah, right across the street from uh, Victor's Liquors. I think Alexi is his friend. <laughs> anyway, let's go in there, man. I can't wait to uh, check this place out. It's awesome. All right, well, I hope someone's here. The sign doesn't say open, so this might be a very short video, uh, in which case you'll find out. <laughs> but uh, yeah, they're supposed to open. Head oh, northwest. Stop, I'm already here. Go away. Leave me alone. Okay, I am here. Just show them some of the stuff I'm trying to sell him. Uh, but yeah, there's some Hot Wheels here. I'll show you the rest of the store in a minute, but um, yeah. Hot Wheels is why I'm here. El Camino. Alright, so my boy Andre was here the other day. He made a video and uh, he saw a bunch of Fast and Furious castings, which I need, even though they're main lines. That doesn't bother me because a lot of the Fast and Furious cars were not um, <clears throat> cast in, sorry, <laughs> here they are, ooh, RX-7, one of those, okay, I have most of those, sadly, have it, oh, there we go. That's a good one. I have to make sure I get them with the Fast and Furious logos. So that's good. So far, we're doing great. <laughs> Look at that. Probably talk like voiceover later. Just don't want to miss anything. That's nice. Kinda sucks because I don't think anyone makes this as a Fast and Furious casting, but that's definitely from that movie. All right. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Never mind. That's definitely not from that movie, but this is. Yes. Hoping he'll uh, hook me up because. I'm trading him some good stuff. Oh look, a Zamek. New for 2019. That's nice. That's a maybe. Kinda 
of hard to see down there. Oh, I have that. I already wheel swapped that bad boy. nice. I don't collect fair ladies though. right back guys all right I pretty much have all the DeLoreans so I'm not even stressing that Ooh, I sent this treasure hunt to uh, Derek in our last trade it was an extra <laughs> oh what are they asking for it here oh 10 bucks nice These are really neat. 10 Pro Stock Camaro. Nice. Ooh. So, Zamek. cool 20 bucks oh I have that one oh, good thing it's protected Weird. Jetsons, Beatles, Barbie. Oh, there's another one of those. This charger. Yeah, it's the same. Okay. Make sure we get a better one. Did I see here? Oh yeah, this guy. Hey Mustang Hunter, look at that. Jeez, I don't have any of those, but I can't can't go for that. But this looks great. Thirty-five bucks. It is a super. It's a lot like the new one from 2021, I think. It's different color wheels. Hmm. Yeah. Not bad. Ooh. Nice. There's a DeLorean back there. I have this one. I do not have this. Oh man. Watching me. <sighs> All right, so probably these guys. All right, going 
going to show you guys around a little bit. Not that big. No, I'm not into wrestling figures. Let's see, I am looking for the original release of Spawn. Not that one. Oh, that's cool. Hmm. Look at this wall. It's wearing some skin over there. Look at those things. Some of you that like pops. Right here. <laughs> Never seen that thing. Cowboy Bebop. Okay, why am I filming pops? I don't like pops. Let's go away from there. <laughs> Just trying to show you kind of the layout of the store. Oh man, that's cool. From Soul Calibur 2. That game was my jam. Me and my br uh, best friend Chris used to, uh, well, we still do sometimes, but this used to be the pastime. Soul Calibur 2. Love that game. Look at those gigantic Star Wars things. Maybe a little too shaky for that far. <laughs> oh man, look at these things. Original Megazord. I used to have like a bunch of those. Now I have a Soul of Shogokin one. Some cheaper stuff down there. I don't care. I only collect uh, Green Ranger stuff nowadays. Look at that. really cool. Ooh, those are freaking nice. Oh, there it is. There's my holy grail. <sighs> Someday. 350 is ridiculously a lot, but that's what it goes for pretty much everywhere. My boy uh, Sprooch of uh, Sprooch uh, on YouTube, he got one at ToyCon New Jersey for way less than that. I was so jelly because I was trying to get the guy. So it's all fair. I'm not <laughs> mad at him. 
He was just there at the right time. Hey, man. Hey, man. What's up? Oh, How you how's it going, man? Uh, let me see your face. Oh, okay. You remember me? A little bit, yeah. I remember the hat. Yeah, no, it's me and uh, my fiance. The last time. Okay. When we came, when we came by, we, we used to hang with Dan. And stuff. Oh my God. Dan yeah. Dan and Mike. Was that um? It was back in Columbus. Dan, little Dan from Trenton. Yeah. Mike. How long ago was that? God, like two years ago? Oh my before God! The pit, before the thing, yeah. Yeah. For the, what shall not before, be named? Before the, the, the Marvel. Oh yeah, there you go. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh my God, nice seeing you again. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you good? Yeah, I'm overwhelmed with everything because I only got ten minutes, and then I have to go because she has to go to work, and it's like, oh man, I get anything I want in this store, but I have to. <laughs> nice. It's but, the dilemma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, same here. I'm trying to trade some um, some of my factory sealed Hot Wheels for some things and sell okay. some of it. So we'll see how that goes. Yeah. But uh, yeah, oh, let me turn. Realistic. <laughs> Talking about Holy Grails. What is your Holy Grail? Um, as far as Holy Grail goes, I think it would have to be, um, honestly, like. It's not just one particular thing, but really just having anything of the Shogun okay. warriors from Japan, like yeah, the yeah. Japanese. I love Japanese uh, Shogun. So the really right my, like. my Holy Grail is just to have everything at, at everything from that line. Mm. So my Holy Grail is really just basically yeah. having. Every figure is a used car. Yeah. <laughs> yep. And I don't care if it's box or not. Oh, yeah, yeah. Jeez. If I had all that, then I would have been good. I mean, like, he has, like, the... Oh, oh right, 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 yeah. The, the, my, my only issue with those are, is, like, they are, like, so many. I don't know what is from Japan, what is not from Japan. Yeah. But they're so cool looking. I mean, look at... I mean, they're works of art. You've heard of Jeremy, Tokyo Toy Bastard? He's a fairly he good... Columbus? No, no, he's in Japan. Oh, okay. He's, he's a, a toy artist. He's um, a collector. Okay. He does. He's not really a dealer, okay, but on. he can probably hook you up. Follow him on Instagram. Hey, man, look he's him up. Probably, yeah. <laughs> Jeremy's a good dude, and I if there's anything you're be, looking for, yeah, I would love to be that guy. So it's Jeremy the, the toy bastard. Tokyo toy bastard. Yeah. Tokyo toy bastard. <laughs> and he's yeah. In Japan. Yeah, he's uh, he literally lives in Tokyo, and he collects this sort of stuff. And um, yeah, so he has like, he has like first crack at oh my god dude he goes to those stores and stuff and th those are the videos to watch for you yeah <laughs> not my nonsense finders for you or like the um you know everything from oh boy she's uh she's sitting there all right <laughs> yeah, a lot of good content coming here with that camera. oh yeah yeah it was tony right tony, yeah. all right nice meeting you man Thank you. <clears throat> Ooh, Piccolo. Kokarot. Nice meeting you, Tony, if you're watching this. He only has 10 minutes, so. <laughs> Alright, back to uh, Pet and my uh, Holy Grail here. How cool is this thing? There you go, guys. Someone send me that. <laughs> I'm kidding, no one has that. Ooh, there's so much to film I'm trying not to uh, spend too much time in here because I do also have to go but uh, there you go also have comics I get those for my collages that comic book nice 180 
need to sell some of my comic books. Okay. Let me give you a quick little wide lens walk through here, and then we'll go to the front. Some really pretty stuff over there. You have your arcades. Oh yeah, that's a good game. That's a really good game. Zeldies. This guy. Keanu. Aw, he's trying to get out. Let him out. So yeah, there's the Hot Wheels. Look through most of them. I'm really interested in these. Well, I don't want the Bugatti. So, here we go. Got a little X-Men Street Fighter happening. Some of you who are not retro video game collectors, this must be a huge blast from the past for you. Got everything you might want here, I guess. I don't know. Obviously all the better stuff is locked up. Oh yeah, I remember when I collected Amiibo, I wanted that big ass one. Metroid Fusion, oh wow, that's 200 bucks. I guess Game Boy games aren't that big. Ooh, Killer Instinct. Nice. The theme song's like blaring in my head. <laughs> Alright. So I already did this walkthrough once, <laughs> but my phone turned off on me, so I'm trying to do this again. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, a face hugger. It's lovely. Looks familiar. Oh, HR Giger. You and your designs. Some shirts. Again, pops that no one wants. <laughs> Simpsons, fantastic stuff. Some stuff on sale. So there we go. Some South Park stuff. Bruce Lee, 36, not horrible, let's see, man I remember finding all this at the flea markets, back when I collected all this stuff, pretty much at all of it, <laughs> I could have uh, filled my own store, there's my favorite. I just can't stop looking at it. It's such a good figure. Jesus. Look how dope that is. Jeez. As a kid, I actually waited in line to get the number one Pit comic book. I lived in Canada at the time. So. All right, let's go see what's up front. The 
whip. Astro boy. Ooh. Yeah, that guy. What do you Looking at uh... Ooh, Roger Wilco. <laughs> nice. Yeah. They sell Ukrainian beer there uh, from my uh, city of birth, Lviv, which translates to lion. But anyway, so yeah, um, House of Fun was fun. Fun intended. Womp, womp, womp. Um, yeah, I'm just not having a good day today. I'm extremely tired and uh, yeah. Sorry about the lack of charisma for YouTube. You're getting the real Nas today. It's rainy and uh, that's how I roll. Ain't no change in the weather. Ain't no changes in me. Sadly, I'm up north, so there's lots of change in the weather. Lots of changes in me. Sing zaroo. So anyway, um, yeah. Uh, House of Fun was cool. Uh, really nice seeing the new location. Um, I am not sponsored by them in any way, trust me, no. Uh, I just got to meet uh, Chris, I believe is his name. Um, but yeah, he's a really nice guy. Uh, ooh! Does anyone think that says f her back and sons? <laughs> f her back! Yay, Aston's, Aston's and Martin's. <sighs> Alright guys, so uh, yeah, uh, I'm about to uh, cross the bridge to Pennsylvania from uh, godforsaken New Jersey. Um, man, everything good's in New Jersey, man. I don't know what's going on. The only good place I know of in Pennsylvania is uh, Brave New Worlds, uh, down, downtown Philly, in Old City Philly. I uh, love that place. Um, but yeah, Brian and everybody there are great. Let me pay this stupid toll. I'll be right back. Alright, toll paid. <laughs> so yeah, um, yeah. let's head over to this bridge. This is the Taconi Palmyra Bridge. The bridge I grew up with up in this hizzy. But uh, anyway, alright, let's get back to my wonderful face. Alright guys, um, so yeah, thanks for joining me. I'm sure you guys enjoyed the uh, craft bags out of this video. Um, there's a lot of eye candy there. Um, I'm gonna be honest about the review, so, uh... Welcome hopefully. to Pennsylvania. Thank you, thank you, robot. In a quarter mile, continue straight onto Levick Street, oh. State Route 1008. Okay, I know where I live, please go away. Thanks. <sighs> Alright, so yeah, like I said, I'm gonna be honest about the review of this place, and, uh, tell you, uh, how my trade went, because I traded in all of my factory sealed Hot Wheels that I got. Continue straight onto Levick Street, State Route 1008. Off. All right, hold on. Let me uh, let me murder this uh, this lady. Uh, her voice. <laughs> All right. Uh, she's been murdered. So welcome back, guys. So yeah, house of fun. Um, new location. Uh, I went to the old location a long time ago when uh, I got together with my flea market buddies and my boy Mel was buying Jetfire, which was in amazing condition. And back then, it was actually way cheaper. Uh, they definitely wouldn't sell it for that price these days. Um, because that was like, oh my god, that was years ago, guys. Like, years. Almost a decade ago. It's crazy how time flies. But, uh, but anyway, uh, walking into this place was amazing. Uh, just colors everywhere. Amazing rare stuff everywhere. From Hot Wheels to freaking, uh, Kaiju, Japanese Safubi, to regular, you know, action figures, American stuff. Like, uh, Simpsons, uh, Spawn, McFarlane stuff, you know. And other, and you saw everything. I'm not gonna make a list, but anyway, again, not paid for the promotion. <laughs> but anyway, um, 
So yeah, I had the rest of my factory sealed uh, cars. Uh, there were no super Zamex or treasure hunts in there. I took those out. Uh, I traded a bunch of them away already. So um, I kept a few, of course. Um, so yeah, that's how I roll. I wasn't trying to scalp these. I could have, uh, literally, I could have made twice as much if I tried to sell these on my own. But you know, if I, I would have to put so much time and effort into this and I would have to pay fees if it was on eBay or whatever. I don't sell on eBay. But um, yeah, I really did not want to deal with any of that and I needed money quick for uh, some things. I'm trying not to burden people with, you know, uh, why I'm selling so much stuff is because of my dad. He, he passed away, so I'm trying to, uh, you know, pay for a lot of bills and stuff like that. So I've been selling a lot of my collection for that cause. So that's why I've been selling so much stuff. And uh, I also don't have the time to uh, like list everything and sell everything one by one. So I went to uh, to this store and um, or shop, I should say, and just decided to sell everything uh, in one go. Uh, sadly, you guys saw that DeLorean Super Treasure Hunt it, thing's amazing. Um, the price wasn't awful. It was like eBay price for that, which it should be. It's uh, not an easy one to find, I guess. But uh, but yeah, he uh, he tried to um, work with me a little bit, uh, give a little bit of a discount for those uh, for that super. Uh, but yeah, uh, since I need the money, I was like, yeah, um, thank you, dude. You know. Uh, he really did like it was a good deal if I wasn't like um, in need of money right now I would have totally gone for that. Um, it, it was a fair enough offer for a shop You know, it wasn't like a guy to guy or whatever. So But anyway, since it is a shop stuff's not cheap, you know, this isn't a flea market uh, So everything's priced according um, You know, so there, there it is and I'm sure if you get to know the guy and uh, you know uh, he would probably work a little bit better with you on the prices. Oh, jeez. <clears throat> yeah, when you're YouTube and driving, don't look at the camera. That's all I gotta say. Um, I'm actually not too far from where that guy hit a tree the other day. So, anyway. Cool. So, uh, yeah. Uh, other than that, man, other than uh, the fact that uh, I really took a huge loss on those uh, factory sealed cars, I'm not gonna tell you how much he gave me, but let's just say it was less than 50 cents per car there were a lot of cars in that case <laughs> that i got rid of so um yeah i had to settle for it i need to pay a bill today i mean tomorrow today's sunday uh so that's what i did man that treasure hunt was so freaking nice man <laughs> but anyway um all right so yeah guys um Thank you for joining me here, man. Uh, sadly, I didn't buy anything. I just walked out with some money. Um, and uh, that's what I was intending to do. Uh, so, yeah. Take a little bit off the for gas money to get there. Take a little bit off for toll money to get back. Um, I didn't make a lot. But I had more than I started this morning. So, nickel and diming my way out of uh, debt. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, those of you that watch my videos, you've seen me do some pickups like that new display case and stuff. All of that was, was purchased um, months ago before, you know, all this happened. So um, I'm not spending new money um, on anything. So don't, uh, any of you who are judging McJudgers, don't like come at me and be like, Hey man, if, if you need so, if you need money, why are you buying stuff? I'm not. <laughs> when I'm at the flea market, I'll buy, I have a, a budget which is $20, and usually um, I, I'm under that budget, so uh, keep your panties on. Oh, that sounds awful. Anyway, yeah, but I mean grown men who bitch and moan, so um, yeah, had to correct that. That just... Ugh. Anyway, uh, okay, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna have to delete that. That just sounds wrong. <sighs> okay, hey, thank you for watching. Um, that's what I had to deal with today. Uh, really fun going to that store. Sadly, I couldn't, um, God, man. Sadly, I couldn't, um, <clears throat> buy that super. And sadly, I couldn't show you more and spend more time in there. There was so much stuff. I just didn't, I just didn't have the time to, uh, to do a free promotion for, <laughs> for that place, which I already did. So if you want to see more, definitely go there and, uh, check it out. Um, Everyone there is nice. There was one guy that was kind of like watching me. Um, I don't know if he works there or not, but it was really awkward. He was like, 
five feet behind me. It was it was strange. Whoever you were, man, why were you? Uh, anyway, I guess I was wearing a trench coat. He's like, oh, he's gonna fill that trench coat with stuff. I don't blame you. You're in New Jersey, so I guess that's how it goes. <laughs> so yeah, and uh, it was also uh, nice meeting uh, the other meeting the other fella. I forgot your name, dude. I'm so sorry, man. Um, I'm the worst with names, dude. Um, but yeah, nice talking to you and uh, running into you again. <laughs> Uh, two years later, somehow we got to run into each other at this store at the same time on the same day, which is really weird. But um, yeah, nice, nice meeting you again. <laughs> uh, but yeah, anyway, the rest of you guys, thank you for joining me on this little trip. Um, it's a nostalgic trip. <laughs> I guess it's another series that I have. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video. You're all awesome. Live long and prosper. And remember, don't be assholes.